on this test flight is testing our uh, radar technology. My name is Jeremiah Pate. I'm the CEO of Lunazon. This is actually the first time that ever a, a VLF, a very low frequency transmitter, has ever been tried before. So this will give us a lot of very useful data on this potentially extremely valuable new technology that we have under development. Hi, I'm Thomas Joseph Militich. I am here with my co-workers Chase Cox and Matthew Russo. We're here representing the Florida Space Institute and Dr. Julie Brisset. Our payload on this rocket is called Space 2, which is the suborbital particle aggregation and collision experiment. The purpose of it is to study early planetary formation during the stage where particles are of such little mass that gravity doesn't play an influence on their aggregation. So Space 2 itself is in it's a quite a large payload. It has four experiment test cells, which each have a series of marbles and other small particles in them. And they have solenoids around them that bang into it and apply energy to these particles to shake them while they're in microgravity. There are also four Pi cameras above the experiment test cells that record it as they uh, collide and aggregate over time. Then we manually track these particles and we watch their velocities before and after collision and see the circumstances under which they aggregate together. And that's sort of the scope of the experiment.